something is going on deep in the mines in this 11th episode of Star Rail. Who knows what will happen? Will we discover new things? We'll find out now. I am who I be, and I be going over here. Also, want to check this out? See my XP? It's still trapped at 20. By the time I actually get above my equilibrium level being 1, it'll already be 30. And I have to upgrade my equilibrium. Anyway, hey, Steel. How you going? Hey, or you came. Whoop. That was fast. I'm about to make a lewd joke. Cover your ears, kids. Well, that's one thing my girlfriend never said. What is Wildfire doing in the mine? What trouble has Wildfire gotten into? Didn't I tell you? Long story short, the underground used to have many mines. However, in recent years, some sort of corrosion called the Fragmentum started to spread. It's ruined a lot of mines. The one we're heading into is relatively unaffected. A bunch of vagrants made it their home after their old turf was consumed by the Fragmentum. Actually, most of them are pretty honest folks. But with such a large group, it's inevitable that troublemakers will find their way in. Oh yeah, They've no been doubt. stealing stuff from the miners and picking fights. And that's not the worst of it. Death? Things are much more serious this time. For two days now, huge clashes have been breaking out between the miners and the vagrants. It isn't pretty. Ah, oh, I can see. Protests. Mines are our lifelines in the underworld. We have to keep providing Geomero to the overworld in exchange for supplies. You'll eventually run out. In order to quell the situation, Chief Oleg brought Wildfire into the mine and left me in charge of security for the towns. But the situation in the mine is critical. I have to back him up. I don't think I understood. Can you go over it again? Yeah, I understood. Oh. As for you, the Chief will decide your fate when we see him. Excuse me? Good. I've been wanting to come face to face with the leader of the underworld. Oh. Oh. You're talking to Bronya. Where is she at? You're about to come face to face with reality. Face to face with reality, yeah, that's... Oh boy, here we go, great mine. I'll be the judge of that. Huh? Isn't that the doctor lady? Oh. You mean my Natasha? I, I actually couldn't find her. That's the reason, I Nat, guess. I didn't think you'd be here. Where's Oleg? Hey, Zila and Sampo's guests. So it looks like you've already met. Yeah. I haven't seen Oleg. The miners said they saw him take a group further in. Uh, these people. What are you doing here? I'm not feeling too good. How are you doing? I heard that the miners had been having violent clashes with local thugs, with significant numbers of wounded. I hurried over here to see if I could help. You see these people? They're all miners and their family members. They want an explanation from the instigators. This area up ahead is a vagrant dwelling, but they've sealed off the entrance. I guess they're afraid that angry miners might try to take revenge. Uh-oh. How could this situation here become such a mess? I heard that first mining team found a geomarrow vein with incredible deposits. <laughs> the initial estimate put it at the largest discovery in the last 30 years. I assume that's not it. If, if they found it, that's bit gotta have been taken like a decade to mine, right? It's not that. That's been there. <laughs> Are you serious? That's big news. How come I never heard about it? Well, they weren't in a hurry to make it known. Most of the mines have been contaminated by the Fragmentum. Many people are out of work. They were afraid of being overwhelmed if they let the word out. Okay. But the vagrants here have keen eyes. They couldn't keep it hidden from them. Some local gangs wanted to profit from the situation, so they blackmailed the mining team for hush money. And that was the final straw. Oh, that's the price of guarding a secret. The vein should belong to those who discovered it. I, I don't know. It depends on who the owners of those who discovered it were. Like, who? Actually, on second thought, why? it's a civil war at this point. You have to use a little bit of politics, maybe. I can understand your thinking. It's just that the underground is in difficult straits. Exactly. Which means, if somebody indiscriminately goes in and, say, destroys it, they'd come together, right? And that's how the clash started. Now both sides are dealing with heavy losses. 
So, are you guys here to help resolve the conflict? I will bash anyone in the face that gets in my way. I am called a peacekeeper. Don't make me become a headkeeper. <laughs> They're here because they need a favor from Chief Oleg. I'm escorting them, and seeing as you need that helping hand, it wouldn't be too much to ask you to lend one here first, right? Yeah, sure, fine. Of course we want to help. We care about other people too, you know. Uh, we came here willing to help out. Sounds like a fair trade-off. Of course it is. Nobody gives without expecting something in return. That not true. Not true. You're too young to know that, though. I believe we're dealing with kind-hearted people here, Zila. As you've all seen, the situation down here is, um, strained. If you can, we would really appreciate you helping the people. Okay, I'm on it. Relics? Oh, hey, that's the thing I have. Uh, okay. Relics, and that's my... Oh! Uh, no! I don't want to choose that! That's old! I don't want to equip that! How dare you make me equip this garbage! That's garbage! I've already bought other things! Why would you make me do this? Stop it! Stop it! Switch back to this, silly. Trying to hold my hand and go in the wrong direction. How dare you? How dare you? How dare you? Huh. Oh, okay. But, let's see. HP. Do I do this? Hmm. Critical damage plus. But, I'm trying to go for critical rate. There is she be! Enhance this puppy. At only three? No, some ain't right. Why, why didn't you add that? Oh, two star. Okay. I'm sorry. There we go. That's more like it. That's not. That's taking a lot. What are you doing? Wait. Huh? Divine Relics 4? Oh, okay. Only has a max of 12, huh? Okay, okay, okay. I get it. I get it. Oh, that's a. Uh, hmm. I'll have to run that by myself and see what the heck is my stats. My stats are critical rate, 26.5%. Uh, is that good enough? I don't know if that's good enough. It, honestly, I don't know. It might not be. But then again, wait, what is this? Uh, HP plus effect hit rate, attack, Attack, uh, HP, crit damage, though. A little bit different. Okay, fine, I'll enhance this. Uh, really? Oh, that's a mighty fine attack. I think. It probably could be better. They're not five stars. I honestly don't know why I did this. That's a lot, I think, but the speed is not high enough as the way I want it. Crit rate is 30%, which, or roughly 30%. That, that I don't know, baby cake. I don't know. I don't know. Honestly, the crit damage isn't that high, though. I'll have to do this. I wish they'd just not get that. Got yeah, a crit rate plus. Oh! <coughs> oh! Nice! Okay. Now, wait a minute. Crit damage plus 5.1%. Dang it. I could, I, I could definitely get an attack boost. The crit damage. Okay. I mean, every percent counts, right? I ain't gonna worry about that too much. The astral image, what? Found some strange items. Relics. Relics! Relics. Those are relics. How do you... Thanks. They look like clothes, though. So what's a relic? <laughs> they are clothes. A construct made from the data stream. Many believe they're linked to the Stellarons and the Fragmentum phenomenon. What are, we refer to as relics or objects corroded in the Fragmentum whose data is saved and then rest reconstructed. Well, thanks. So what's a relic? <laughs> that didn't explain anything. You could in consult Herda. She's an expert in relic research. Okay. Well, I don't get a Stellar Jade for that. Yeah, you, how slimy are you? Oh wait, what the heck is this? Okay, I get ya. Complaint wool was this? What's in here? Oh, 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 sweet! Oh, I got a hundred! Yeah! Complete. That is perfectly fine. You know what? Screw it. Get out of my way. Get out of my, get out of my way. Uh, oh, do I have to listen? Whoa! Encoder overloaded. Stop being overloaded. Whoa, that was a very delayed sound effect. 
what? Doing this YouTube thing is hard, so you can support the seaweed dweeb on Buy Me a Coffee in the link in the description. We want to create a website that will intrigue everyone, fit with music, novels, videos, podcasts, and posts about things. Sponsor us. We love you even if you don't. Sub and like and bell and stuff, and enjoy the rest of the show. What the heck going on? Don't come any closer. The road's blocked. Stay where you are. Nah, I can take you all down. Oh, easy. Why are you hiding in there? Don't you know what happened in the mine? Well, what's that got to do with us? Do you think we're the same as those thugs? Is uh, anyone with you injured? We have a doctor. She could care for your wounded. Yeah, right. And you can guarantee that no one there with you is out for blood. I don't believe it. Stay where you are. Uh-huh. Well, if you are that, you know, uh, cautious, you might be out for blood yourself. These guys. Yeah, they have shovels. Come on. Fight me. Fight me and prove you're a man. You want me to go over there, but... Oh. Oh. I get it. The giant blam vein. The one they discovered. That must be where the clashes are centered. Come on. That person up ahead. That can't Is be the vein. Is he asleep? Let's head up and take a look. He might need help. Dang, dude. He did. Peak? Oh, that's his name. Falling asleep in a place like this. Impressive. Yeah, I've slept in harder stuff. Hey, wakey, wakey. You'll get mushrooms growing on your head. Yeah, and then we can turn them into eggs and bacon, too. Yeah, eggs and bacon with mushrooms. Have you ever had that? Uh, mushroom bread? I can't see it on the menu. Masila! See it on the menu? What? Have you got a death wish or something? How can you sleep here? Get back to safety and take shelter. Take shelter? I remember now. These guys came out of nowhere and got into a fight with the mining team. At the time, I was exhausted. I'd hardly run a few feet when one of them caught me. If it weren't for wildfire, they'd have stolen the clothes off my back. And then, where did wildfire go? They take... they take your clothes? These ones? You don't know these guys. No moral compass. They'd rob you blind in a flash. It's only thanks to wildfire that the Great Mine hasn't fallen under their control completely. Yeah, nothing's nothing defines a thug than knocking someone out and stealing their shoes. Speaking of which, where is wildfire? Did they head further in? Is there a fight happening? Oh, I don't know. I mean, we could have a fight if you want to. Your boots do look kind of my style, though. It seems like Chief Oleg must be up ahead. Hurry up and get back to safety. Look for Nat. And try not to get into another scrap along the way. It's just down there. You shouldn't be able to do that. <laughs> okay. Thank you for, um, getting me on my feet. If I get back soon enough, I'll have time for a, for a nap. Yeah, sure. Just don't fall. Just don't fall. I recognize that woman. That's Elaine from First Mining Team. Quick, let's get up there and see if she's wounded. We're right in front of her. What do you mean up there? Elaine, are you okay? Are you hurt? Uh, Zila, thank goodness. I I I'm fine. Just a couple of sprains. Sprains? You've got good timing. Those vagrants were asking me about the robots. But I don't know anything. Robots? Doesn't ring a bell. Oh, don't you know? The intersection of the Great Mine has been seized by a band of robots. Neither the mining team nor the vagrants can get anywhere near. Oh, crap. So it is like a Endeavor situation. There are two groups that want something, but that once one something is guarded by a group that wants both gone. <laughs> New challengers enter. About time. Human-only conflicts are so boring. I agree. Does anyone know where the robots come from? Huh. Might have come from the surface. <sighs> At first, we thought that a collective fault had occurred in the excavation machines. But then we found out that those machines didn't even belong to the mining team. Yeah. See that? That's, uh... uh there's a light... That's a traffic light. You know what traffic lights are. On the surface. They came out of nowhere and pushed the vagrants and us back. Then they blocked off the only tunnels into the intersection. Uh, maybe someone's playing tricks? 
There's no way anyone in the mining team is behind this. Operating a single unit is tiring enough, but a whole group? <laughs> Impossible. Surface. Then there's only one possibility. Boss Svarog. Maybe? I guess you could glean that. It is surface level stuff, after all. Svarog? That name sounds familiar. You remember the robots we defeated in the boxing gym? Oh! Oh, Boss Svarog's robots! What's his deal? Let's just say he's not to be trifled with. I'm a trifle him. Let's go and find some other people. Elaine, can you make it back to safety? No problem. Zila and the rest of you, be careful. Duly noted! Robots? It's already been 19 Aligned minutes. Humans? I've never heard of such a thing. Machines should obey humans and. Wait! Uh, is this crap. elevator broken? Why isn't it r responding? Because it's broken. Why are you worried about this piece of junk? Do you really want to go down there and be a live target for the robots? That sounded like Gart. Was that Gart? But if we evacuate, then haven't we lost out? <sighs> you idiots will just steal off the miners. Look, I saw with my own eyes. They managed to bag some Geomara. This is a perfect opportunity. That sounds too much like Gart. Oh, good idea. Shameless. Still after the miners, are you? Time to teach you a lesson. What? What? Wait a second. I have no interest in I didn't conflict. understand what was going on. This song's for you. Keep up. Oh crap, I don't have any of the, uh... Well, poop. Ready to lose yourself? You can fight it. Or rock with it. Let's go. Ah, whoa, okay. Yeah, battle over. Oh, just with the music was getting good. <laughs> Fleeing at the first sign of danger. That's all they're good for. What? I seem to remember knocking them clean out cold of their consciousness. Huh? What's this? Did those guys leave it behind? Leave what behind? Whoa, what was that? Whoa, whoa! Was that what you were talking about? What the heck? I'm assuming not. Beep, beep, beep! Searching for potential user. Potential user? Beep, beep! Voice print detected! Looking up corresponding identity information. Oh my, it's an alien! Hey, it talks! Oh, and we it are an we alien! Are from this planet? It doesn't seem to be technology from here. Look, it even has an International Peace Corporation logo on it. Where? I don't... Perhaps it's an antiquity left behind by some past interstellar traveler. Beep, beep, beep. Your mom's an antiquity? Ooh, how are you gonna spec burn that? Ooh, sick burn! How you gonna how you gonna put that fire out that's on your tail, Don Hung? Beep, beep, beep! Whatever, whatever. So you aliens know about the Interastral Peace Corporation? That's great! Beep, beep, beep! Self-introduction. I am Richard, the home use object finder. Model uh, information. Version 0.63. Professional model, annual deluxe package. Nickname, Findy. Findy? A home use object finder? Who knew the IPC made these kinds of products? Beep, beep, beep. My brainwave scanner module is damaged. Please send me to an interastral peace appliances retail store near you for free repair within the warranty period of 232 years, 84 days. Beep, beep, beep. Alien, please take me to an Interastral Peace Appliances retail store to conduct repairs. What? This spell is already broken. Uh, okay. What should we do? Take it with us? I don't know. It could be a liability. Uh, let's take it. Maybe it could be of some use. My inventory is already maxed out. Uh, you need to log out once in a while. What? What does that have to do with inventory? Let's take it with us. It doesn't take up much room. And if it really is broken, there are trash cans everywhere. Uh, yeah, that's true. Beep, beep, beep. Not a trash can. Yes, yes, yes. When you need to find something you can't see, just call upon Findy. That's me. Eh, we even got a slogan. Lift controller. Where am I going? I'm going over here. Hey, want to see me do a crime? Damn. 
I broke them dudes back. Wait, I only hit him? Uh, fine. Yeah. Uh. Oh, sh oh, I didn't even have to do anything. Ouch. Oh, you did not do that. Oh, okay. Nice. Reach the end of the story Flex. in your own way. Cha charge. That way! Yeah! The leader of the robots, Svarog. We meet him on the next video. Click this video to watch that scenario. But if you don't see it right now, subscribe for more and watch the previous videos if you haven't caught up to this point. So, never forget, I love you and catch it next time.